Those two moments are going to be hard to top, but we're going to try to do that with the best plays of the last seven days on the high school hardwood. It means it's time for your Wendy's Play of the Week nominees. We start with play number one, where it is ice water in this kid's veins. Game tied. Final uh, seconds. Stoltz, Zach Dory to Huntington North, three. and uh, you bet it. He drains it from straight away. 51, that triple. Way to get at the buzzer Zach for the Vikings to beat Plymouth 51 uh, Stoltz, to 48. Well, that's going to be hard to beat, but play number two, pretty good too. What a weekend for Central Noble. Sidney Freeman, the junior with the shake and big bucket. Nice fake there. That layup in the fourth quarter, icing the game as Central Noble wins semi-state. They'll play for a state title on Saturday down in Indianapolis. How about play number three? Riley Perlick with the power inside the Carroll Senior with the and one here and that bucket in the fourth quarter, putting Carroll over the top as the Chargers beating rival Homestead to clinch Carroll's first ever SAC title. And by now, hey, you know what to do. You go to Wayne.com, vote on what you think should be the Wendy's Play of the Week. Voting closes in that poll at 11 o'clock, and we'll announce your winner tonight on Nightcast. Sticking with